Things really kind of settled down. Here's an opening chance here by Senegal. Look at El Haji Zouk, just step by the man, and then gets taken down by Fabian Carini. Carini gets a yellow, Senegal gets a PK. This was a bad call, though. Well, Zouk's just so fun to watch in this tournament. It's a shame he's got to change it by acting here. As the goalie did a great job getting out of the way. Zouk just begging for the penalty here. And there you see a cleaner look at the replay and the dive. Yeah, didn't even touch him. Kalilu, Padiga, 1-0 Senegal. Sometimes for a keeper, penalties obviously just guesswork. Guess what? Guessing the wrong way here. Move the 26th minute. One of the best names in this tournament. Papa Buba Diop. Look at Ari Kamara make the run. Spots up big Papa Pump. He pumps one in, 2-0 Senegal. Well, this play is completely created on the left side as Henry Kamara just streaks down the left side with speed and continues to attack the left flank and makes an excellent pass into Diop. Look at, look at his speed right there. Attacking the left flank, takes a look, and makes a nice little square ball to Diop for the finish. And you can't say Diop doesn't know what to do with it. Great service, just takes it wide of the keeper. Good first time volley. Yeah, that one fine side netting. 38th minute, those two hook up again. Kamara will do the crossing pass and Diop will kind of come out of nowhere, get his boot on it, and boom, just like that, it's 3-0 Senegal. Can't tell you how tough that is either. Taking that ball first time out of the air and he just puts it in the side netting. Take a look at this ball. Definitely even. Good call by the referee. Ah, see ya. So this one's all over but the shouting, right? Uh-uh. Start of the second half, Uruguay had a, had a pretty good locker room speech, apparently, because they came out smoking. We have some chaos in the box, ball bouncing around. Finally, Richard Morales there, tucks it home. It's a two-goal game, that in the opening seconds of the second half. Well, this comes on the account of another Papa. Diop, but Papa Malak Diop, look at number four, he has the play originally, but then he leaves Morales open for a split second, allowing him to get the little tap in. Yeah, poor defending, let him back in, but also poor goalkeeping, and as he's backwards there, we talked about the goalie standing up, he doesn't do it. This is the 69th minute, how about Diego Forlon, what a volley, it's a one goal game! What a volley and what a touch preparing himself, great chest trap right here, and just takes a nice dipping volley, back post to score the goal. Well, that's a great first touch, but the goalie's thinking here, get out and close this guy. No free ones. Ah, too late. So it's 3-2 to two Senegal, trying to hold on to that lead. Uh -uh. Here comes Uruguay. Another PK situation as Dario Silva dragged down. Rather, that was Morales pulled down, and Alvaro Recoba converts the PK. We're tied at three. It's 93rd minute. What in the world is the keeper doing that far out of the line? Uruguay tries to make him pay, but his defender's there to clear it out with the crown of his head. And that's exactly what you want to do as a defender when you see your keeper out in a situation like that. Here's a good crack on goal, but look at the defender. Does everything, he's shielded, blocked, head ball out, saving the keeper. Love the reactions from the Uruguayan head coach.